Hello everyone, uh, this is Lakshman. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In the today's session, I'm going to explain how to get job as a Java full stack developer position for experienced candidate. Many of the candidates used to mail me. So how to get job as a Java full stack developer position for experienced candidate above uh, two years of experience. And what are the topics uh, the entry panel will focus uh, during the technical interview? So I will explain all these things uh, in this session. Okay. So first of all, uh, who is full stack developer? As you know, a full stack developer is nothing but who can handle uh, front end and back end technologies and servers and uh, database related te technologies, each and everything. So he is the responsibility to end to end project implementation. Now let us see what are the topics or concept you must uh, concentrate now let us see what are the concepts or uh, topics you must prepare before attending any technical interview as a java full stack developer okay so nowadays the latest uh, technologies for java backend technologies are spring boot so most of the uh, entry panels will focus on uh, Spring Boot related entry questions. First, the entry panel will start with uh, core Java related entry questions uh, like uh, Java 8 version, Java 7 or Java 8 version. So most of the times entry panels will ask Java 8 version only. So that to uh, collections related, Lambda related and stream related entry questions may expect. So most of the times collections related entry questions from Java 8 version. So once the entry panel will happy uh, with your answers, he will move into Spring Boot related entry questions, Spring Boot and microservices architecture level entry questions. How you are involved in integration and how you are configured uh, from um, Spring Boot to microservice architecture level. Okay, so there are a lot of questions may ask from Spring Boot and microservices architecture level entry questions. So the entry panel will focus 70% of the interview uh, Java 8 version and uh, uh, Spring Boot and microservices. And then he will move into front end technologies like uh, uh, ReactJS or AngularJS. But nowadays ReactJS technologies is very popular. So that is the reason who are uh, learning or who are not yet learning, please prepare React.js uh, technology to build the user, um, to build user interfaces for front-end technologies. Uh, React.js is mostly used in IT company nowadays. From the React.js, you may expect like how you are um, integrating from front-end to uh, microservices how we are building the relationship uh, from React.js to microservices. Can you explain the flow? So they may ask a lot of questions from React.js as well. Okay, so once uh, an entry panel will be happy with, with your answers, then he will move to, so have you, um, have you experience in cloud related environment like AWS? So if you say yes, then he may ask uh, AWS related entry questions also. Okay, so 80% of the interview for Java full stack dollar position from these concepts only Java 8, Spring Boot, microservices. So it depends on the project related and job, uh, job requirement. Okay, so most of the uh, companies, 80 to 90% of the companies will use to ask for any Java full stack developer requirement, these skills only. Java 8, Spring Boot, microservices for front end technologies, React JS or angular uh, some of the companies will ask angular requirement also and uh, if you have st if you are strong in javascript to learn react js or angular js is nothing okay and then any cloud uh, provider any cloud service environment like aws or azure or anyone but most preferably every company uh, used to ask aws amazon web services preparing these topics you have to concentrate on uh, like uh, a debugging skills as well so you have to focus on some uh, unit testing level concepts as well so some entry panel will be interested to ask unit testing how to write a unit test as well okay so before attending the interview prepare how to write uh, unit test cases how to write unit test cases as well okay and then 
you must be uh, some additional skills as well nowadays so every company is uh, uh, looking for who have multiple skills candidate so nowadays uh, uh, for java full stack developers they are expecting uh, Kafka related experience as well. Also, you must have experience on any uh, API related like RESTful web services. So, if you are uh, prepared these technologies, these areas, then you can easily crack the Java full stack dollar position for experienced candidate. You might be three years of experience or four years or five years of experience. If you are more than five years of experience candidate, then uh, you will have to prepare some uh, DevOps related tools as well like Docker, okay, Kubernetes, okay, and some other uh, big data related technologies like Kafka, okay, and Hadoop related, okay. So the companies will expect multiple skills candidates nowadays, okay. Don't forget that point, okay. Uh, so these are the topics or concept you have to brush up before attending a technical interviews as a Java full stack dollar position more than three years of experience candidate, okay. So once again, I am telling you guys, so Java 8, Spring Boot and microservices for front-end technologies, React is or Angular, okay. And any cloud related uh, entry questions, uh, especially AWS related entry questions and uh, other skills you have to prepare like uh, uh, Git or GitHub. So it's not a mandatory, but if, if you prepare, it is well and good. Okay. And automation related uh, skills like uh, continuous integration, continuous deployment. Okay. And also if you have experience on RESTful web services, okay it is well and good it is a very added uh, advantage for you okay so these are the skills you must prepare before attending technical interview so if you have any doubts on this uh, session please comment in the comment section i will reply to your queries all guys for this session we'll meet in the next video thank you bye bye